Hey guys, it's Kevin Lavroni in the house. TLR. It's been a while since I uh, posted up a training video. Of course, I've been very, very busy with family things. My five year old son started school. You know, there's a lot going on uh, personally. But I've also been in the gym. This is actually, I'm at my home gym right now. Uh, I've been doing my cardio in the morning. Uh, actually, let me show you guys my cardio machines, my ellipticals, and uh, everything right there, my bikes. So, but anyway, one thing that I want to let you guys know that I never forget about working out in the TLR and the mission. The mission is endless transformation. And even when I'm not posting up videos, just know that there's still something that I'm doing, and I hope you guys are doing that as well. The TLR started because I wanted to have a place where you guys could come and have a voice, a voice to be heard around the world. There's no other IFBB professional bodybuilder on the level where I'm doing what I'm doing, uh, giving you guys free advice. So I hope that you guys are learning from that. I hope that you guys are prospering from that. I wanted to address something that you know I've been getting emails in about some of you guys not feeling. Uh, probably, you know, comfortable with where you are and who you are and what you look like. Not all the time when you wake up and you look in the mirror, you're going to like what you see. There's moments when I look in the mirror where I don't like what I see, but I still continue to move forward and never quit and never give up. And I just want to tell you, if you're out there and you're feeling uh, like an outcast, if you're feeling like you don't fit in with society, don't try to fit in with society. Just be who you are. And being who you are and true to the core, when God created you, He created you perfectly. Just know that. You are special. And there's always someone looking at you, regardless if you think that you're uncomfortable or you feel you're uncomfortable with where you are. There's always someone looking at you saying, you know what, I want to be like that person. Truly believe that and always stay strong. You know, and it's one thing that I always gravitate towards is, uh, you know, that, you know, there is a God. And, you know, prayer certainly helps me. You know, make it through my struggles, and I'm just normal, just like you guys are. Even though I'm Kevin Lavroni, but also a normal guy, and that's why I created TLR so that we could be one on one with each other. So, all you guys on YouTube, thank you for the mad respect. Uh, we just launched a, a single off the new album called Crying School, and people are saying, "Well, why is the album called Crying School?" Well, the album's called Crying School because it's a story of my life, pain and struggles. And the things that I've been through, adversity. You know, I lost my father when I was uh, a kid. You know, my mother died right out of high school. So, you know, for me in my life right now, my son, you know, that's that's the driving force for me. It keeps me going, and you guys keep me going, and all the fans that I've met through this awesome dream that I once had when I was a kid to be a bodybuilder. I never thought that my dream would come true, but it did. Now, moving forward to the TLR, um, Lavroni Report, you know, um, I just want to say that you know we had to uh, make a little more restrictions in the comment section on the front page of the blog of the TLR because I try to run a clean house where there's no derogatory statements, where there's no pan profanity or anything like that. We do have some women coming in. We do want to have more women and feel you know so they can have a voice and so on and so forth on the TLR. There's certain members on the TLR who's been there for a very very, very long time. You guys mean a lot to the TLR, but you know there's going to come a time where when you have something to say, um, and you know I got I got to just say this, Mitchell R. You know you, uh, you over a year ago you sent out videos to uh, not videos but emails to certain members on the TLR about you weren't happy with certain things. You're more than welcome to email me. Any guy, anyone out there listening, you guys can email me at lavroni2000 at yahoo.com. That's my personal email. Send it to me instead of uh, sending it to other members on a TLR. So because there's so much going on on the Leverona Report blog, uh, you have to log in now before you can post a comment. Uh, your comments will be approved because I'm no longer allowing profanity on the front page of the TLR. I want to keep that positive. We're going to move forward and um, you know finish Rob's 405 bench quest. And I want to be repping out 405. So the next video you guys see of me, I'm actually going to be in the gym repping out 405. Moving forward, I know uh, Mitchell R had some 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 ideas about uh, what where we should take this, the canyon run, 
um, you know, uh, the finger man, and so on and so forth. I like your ideas, honestly. I, I think you have some good ideas. But one thing about me, being the professional that I am, I don't like to go back and rewrite that book. So thank you for your advice. But then again, you know, I always say this, unless you've, oh, you know, there's an old Indian motto that says, oh, great spirit, grant that. I mean, not criticize a neighbor until I've walked a mile in his moccasins. You know, there's been also a lot of criticism going on in the TLR about, you know, uh, Kevin doing this and doing that, you know, uh, where are we at? So, you know what? I'm going to bring that structure back in for you guys because I see that you guys need that structure. Also, you know, I want to have a doctor come in. We could talk about the, uh, the benefits of wine, you know, um, the benefits that wine, a glass of wine a day has for your heart, has for your body. And then also, how many of you guys actually know where your testosterone level is? Because that plays a huge role in, you know, your emotions, how you feel throughout the day. You know, um, do you wake up? Are you in a bad mood when you wake up? Or do you wake up, you know, feeling good? You know, I actually wake up, I feel good right now about myself. And I want you guys to feel good too. So I challenge you guys to get your testosterone levels checked um, because it's very important. And then also we have the Arnold Classic coming up. I'm trying to jam all this in real quick. We have the Arnold Classic coming up. I'm going to be in Columbus, Ohio at the Arnold Classic. I'm going to be um, doing a play-by-play -play along with Sean Ray, but I'm there for muscular development, which is awesome. Muscular development has given me also a, another, another column. It's not really another column, but it's an article. It's called How I See It. So I write about things, philosophical things, but truthful things about how, how I see it and how I feel. You always want to come from that truthful place. Um, and I think that's very important. So go out and get the MD Magazine. Check out how I see it. Check out the last call. And then also, yes, guys, that is me on, uh, you know, the TOR. You know, I've, I've, I've had to step up the, I have to step up the pace because I saw you guys were writing about, you know, it was just going in a negative direction. I don't like negativity. So I don't want you guys to be prone to negativity and to be open up to negativity. We got to keep things positive and moving forward in a very positive way. I asked you guys to host shows because I don't want it to be all about Kevin Lavroni. You know, the Oprah Winfrey show is not all about it's Oprah, even though her, sh her name is on that show. It's still a show about the other person, the other guests' lives that, that, that come on her show. So, you know, I, I, this has to be about you guys as well. I know you guys have been participating big time. Cindy, big kudos off to you uh, and everyone else out there. So moving forward, guys, yeah, I want to get ripped and shredded. Summertime's coming up. So that's going to be my goal after Rob does his 405 uh, chest quest, you know, the challenge. My goal is to get ripped, shredded. I'm going to document everything here on the TLR, my nutrition and everything, day in, day out. You guys are going to follow me. I challenge you guys to follow me so that you can get where you want to be. Okay, summertime's coming up, so let's move forward to those goals. Lever Olympia is right around the corner. Um, Hollander, you said something about, hey, Kevin, give us a rundown about the Lever Olympia or tell us a little bit about what's going on with that. The Lever Olympia is an online, it's not a contest, it's on, you guys are challenging yourself, but it's a stage where you can go online, post up a picture before and after. Uh, within 12, 12 weeks, we want to see a 12-week uh, change from where you look now to 12 weeks from now and do all your training. Uh, we're going to have a section on the forum section for Lever Olympia 2012. Uh, the winner of the 2012 uh, Lever Olympia will be awarded a gift from me and I'm thinking it's a $500 gift. You know, it's just going to be a gift. Last year I offered tickets to the Miss Olympia. Uh, this year it might be tickets to the Miss Olympia and something else, but I'm still kind of like throwing around what I'm going to do for you guys. All right, I'm going to participate myself, but I'm not going to be, you know, just competing for anything. But you guys, we're going to pick the best overall, um, uh, the most improved person, male or female. So feel free to jump in, you know, and, 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 and just, you know, set that goal high for yourself and accomplish that goal because it's always good to plan, plan ahead. And take little steps each day and you will, like Cindy, you know, get closer to your goal. If not, get exactly where you want to be and, you know, and you'll be happier, you know, like she is right now. So big kudos off to you, Cindy, and everyone else out on the TLR. Big shout out to Raul Cruz for all the help that he's doing with uh, the production of the um, Avalanche CD, which is a 
a new CD that we're going to be coming out with, hardcore music, all my fans, you guys have been asking for music from me. But you know what, man? Let's focus on the positive stuff, not the negative stuff, because believe me, there's a lot of times when I walked across the Miss Olympia stage and I did not win. You know, my, my title is I got 25 first place, 18 second place, and then the rest was was uh, top four, top five out of 60 some contests. So you know what, guys? You guys can follow me on Twitter. Uh, you guys can follow me on Facebook. But if you want to follow me on Twitter, the links are setting right there on the TLR. You can just click on that link. Every day I'm posting up something positive on Twitter and on Facebook. I wish I could do it on the TLR. But you know what? You guys would get sick of just quotes from me like, hey, you know, keep your head up high, good, better, best. Never let a rest until your good is better and better than the best. You know, some will, some won't, so what, right? But, uh, you know, just stay focused, man. This is Kevin Laroni, TLR. We got some good stuff coming up. Summer's around the corner. And for you guys who are going to be at the Arnold Classic, I'm looking forward to seeing you there. This is Kevin Laroni, man. Peace. And uh, Norwegian? Yeah, that's me, baby. There's another side that comes out. And that's the Merlin Muscle Machine. He can get pretty hardcore, you know, when he's typing. So that's what's up, guys. Peace. God bless. And keep your head up.